Go ahead and turn the car off. Give me the keys. You know why I stopped you? You're going 85 miles an hour and you almost went off the road. Twice. Do you have your license, registration, insurance? Alpha 12, you start this way, this shirt, man. 100%. Alpha 12, you get your registration and insurance too? Um, you still live on Gandhi and uh, St. Pete? No, I don't. It, I just bought this car. So I'll tell you, the first thing that drew my attention to you is I saw you slam on your brakes and end up in the inter middle of the intersection back there. Do you have your license for, or do you have your registration and insurance? And then, like I said, you got up to 85 miles an hour and you went off the roadway twice. You overcorrected. I thought I was going to watch you crash. I'm sorry. Where are you coming from? Uh, Johnny Mangoes. Johnny Mangoes? How much do you have to drink? Um, a little bit. A little bit? Yeah. Looks like a lot of bit. Yeah. Get that registration insurance? Um. You got the insurance? You look like you're having difficulty dividing your attention. I'm guessing, is this not your insurance right here? Sure is. Alright. Give me one second. Where are you headed to? You heading home? Yeah. So you live on... All right, Emily. I'm suspecting that you're driving under the influence, all right? So I want to do some roadside exercises with you, okay? So go ahead and step out with me. Come on back over. Oh, watch yourself. This officer is going to give you a pat down, make sure you ain't got no weapons. All right, come on over here for me. Do you have any medical condition with your eyes not corrected by glasses? Yes, sir. Are you able to walk a straight line? Yes, sir. Huh? Yes, sir. And can you balance on one foot? Yes, sir. All right, go ahead and take a step forward for me. All right, bring your feet together, hands at your sides. Hands down. All right. You see this red light? Yes, sir. You're going to follow the red light with your eyes only. Keep your head still, you understand? Mm-hmm. Stay with it. Stay with the light. Don't move your head. on to the next exercise. All right, Emily, if you will go to this side of the line for me, place your left foot onto the line for me. Left? Yep. All right, now place your right foot in front, heel touch and toe. Make sure they're touching. No, don't start yet. 
You gotta put your left foot on the line, right foot, right foot in front, heel touch and toe, arms at your sides. Arms down. All right, now hold that position. Don't start until I tell you to. If you come out of the position, just get back into it. Just like that. All right? When I tell you to begin and not before, then you're gonna take nine heel to toe steps, just like this. One, two, three, all the way up till nine. Imagine this is your ninth step, leave that front foot where it's at. Take a series of small steps to turn around and take nine heel to toe steps back. It's important that once you start, you don't stop. Keep your arms at your sides and count your steps out loud. Do you have any questions? Yes, sir. Very good. Get back into the position for me. Feet touching. Feet touching. All right, go ahead and begin. Are you still doing the walk and turn? No. All right, what are you doing? No, hold on, hold on. I don't want to give you a hug. What are you doing? <laughs> you want to move on to the next exercise? No? Well, I got to tell you something, your tailor warnings. If you don't do the exercise, you're not going to dispel my concern that you're driving under the influence. And actually enforce me to make an arrest based on the totality of the circumstances as I know them. The last, it will be used against you in court. Do you understand all that? Can you repeat that? Sure. If you don't do the exercises that I'm asking you to do, you're not going to dispel my concern that you're driving under the influence. Next, you're going to force me to make an arrest based on the totality of the circumstances as I know them at this point. And it will be used against you in a court of law. Do you understand all that now? Do you understand? Shaking your head yes. Verbal answer. Yes or no? Yeah. All right, do you want to do the exercises? You want to finish up? No. No? All right. You're under arrest for drunken driving. Can you turn your wrist around here so that they don't get stuck? And if I remember correctly, last time you were with me, you slipped the cuffs, so I'm going to put them on a little tight. I'm sorry, I'm like have a hair on my face.
Hold on, don't move. No, you don't move. And the side. Oh, Lord. The side I'm sorry. That's it? Thank you. Hi. Hi, how are you? I've been better. Alright, uh, we're gonna get out of here, alright? Can you take me home? Yeah, After we go where we're going. Please don't tell me it is where it is. It's the same place we went last time. Which is? Gun Club. Which is? Gun Club. Gun Club? Gun Club. We're going to the Gun Club? Yep. Why? Because you're under arrest. We're going to the gun club? The gun club? The gun club. Why? Because you're under arrest. 